Once again, the dopest entertainment show shall be televised. On the show, we break down and dissect the biggest entertainment stories and we do not hold back. While we're at it, if it's big, it's here. If it's not, it's there. You already know. Anyways, I've got with me some of the industry's finest and they go by the names Ife Omai and Emerald Emenuka. What were you about to do? Emenuka. Okay. What were you about to do? Nothing. <laughs> <laughs> How you guys doing, man? You look dash well, as you. always. Mm, thank you, you too. Always, what? thank you. I know that, I know that. Thank you. You, you don't have to. If I used to remind me every single time, I should give you compliments. Oh, you don't have I to swear. compliment me. I know I look good, darling. Yeah, well, my friend, clear out. Don't you get let's it? Let's hear, let's hear. When you know, you know. When you're big, you're big, you're big. You feel me, eh? Let's, not, let's not even go into your Okada man jeans. But <laughs> my what? Your Okada man jeans. Really, this one? No, not this. Well, so you knew, no, this you, one. No, not this one. I don't okay. have no Okada man jeans. Yeah, you do. The Please. one I gave to my Okada. What is it? What is I don't it understand. With? I don't what understand. No, 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 like, like, no. You need to speak to me. You know, some men have that, right? You, you know, wait. Okay, don't lie. You know the jeans I'm talking about. Yeah. When I talk, okay. Oh, yeah. Don't let me call your time to call you. <laughs> and I was about to buy jeans. I showed to you. Eh? The one I was about to buy jeans and I showed to you. Yes. That Quincy was saying, yeah. no, go for it, man. This is how you wear it, bro. Quincy will lead you astray, please. <laughs> anyways, anyways, um, we're back again. Yes, it's us. Yeah. And we're about to make you guys, you know, entertain. We've got to get you entertained again once again. And today, yes, the first thing we'll be talking about is Nollywood actor Peter Doche was blamed domestic violence on feminism. That's not even a story we want to discuss, but I just mm -hmm. want us to touch on it know real that quick. Domestic violence is like a million years older than feminism, first of all. So they don't align. Feminism only started in the 1800s, like late 1800s, when they brought out no, their pants. I was pants going to get school today. I and came with my pen. <laughs> <laughs> like, it started eight, like, later, later, later. There was already, like, voting. There was mm. kind of, like, a lot mm. of, you know, civilization going on. And in the industrial era, man, but they've been beating each other. Human beings have been beating each other but for think, a long time. Uh, what I was trying to so, say... What I was trying to say is that... Um, Let me you bash know, women so of, I can make my point. No, yeah. no, 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 no. No, this thing saying? of, um, <laughs> you know, standing up, standing up against your man, like, yeah. every time your man speaks, like, your man tells you to do, or you don't know how to cook, you're like, okay, as a feminist, I don't really need to know how to he cook. He was being... I can, you get... So he was particular about certain things. It wasn't so because just I, don't know, I don't know how to cook, I deserve to chop slap. Or you being defensive. Yeah, I deserve to chop slap. That's not what he's saying. No, okay, that's, yeah, that's not what he's what, saying. He's saying that's violence. That's not what it is, um, but... What, what, what he said was, or what I understand from what he said is that um, oh. when, take for example, he, he, in fact, he was making that particular one, like he was hitting on it that women don't know how to cook these days. Mm. And then maybe if the partner, their husbands say da 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 da, they're like... We're here, da, 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 and then the man gets angry and hits you. Mm. So he's saying that okay. women are the ones that provoke ha. this men that to do women this are not thing. I don't understand you. Yeah, that women are not okay. And I'm asking anymore. the both of you: submission, lack of submission equals of being no. We're against domestic no. violence, okay. but if we really, really want to look at it, do you really want to say it's, you know the patriarchal system where a man feels like I'm in charge, which is what feminism, of course, is trying to change mm -hmm. equality. You cannot be carrying shoulder for me; I'll carry shoulder back. Mm -hmm. You understand? But you think that in our system where we still pay bride price so on to wait 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 i did say it though i'm not the one who created the rule i'm not the one who created the tradition where we still pay bribe i'm talking generally now Go don't on. look at me no she's looking at me funny just, just no i'm not going to ignore her. stop looking at me like that first okay <laughs> uh -huh, now i'm safe so i didn't make the look i didn't make the rules right you still go and pay by price. They, then a man now hands over his daughter to you. This is your woman. You now go. And then she wants to start raising shoulder. Not me, oh. Don't look. Not me. Me, I won't think like that. I thought Bri Bri was supposed to say thank you for raising this beautiful person Which coming to my raising home. This beautiful. To... It's more like, this days, it's more like you're paying for what you're getting. In fact, it's a retirement plan if for it, a lot of men. That's not true. That is what it is. That okay. is what they have turned it to. It's supposed to be what you're saying it is. But that's not what they're using it for no more. Now, these days, they don't even need to know where you have where the man. They, they don't know how long you guys have dated. As long as you can afford to pay the bride price, the woman is yours. It's true. That's what is happening these that's days. That's what is happening. I'm not even joking. But that's not what bride price is supposed yeah, to be That's not for. what it's supposed to bride be. Bride price is supposed to be is like, um, uh, like this woman is coming to, into my like home you spend so much to come and um, make a home for me, which is what she was doing in your house. Because women are, I, I mean, culturally speaking, women will tender to the family mm -hmm. and then the one, that man will go out to, to 
farm or whatever. So you're supposed to be taking care of the house and everything. Mm -hmm. So thank you for raising a, a mm -hmm. wife that can do that and then I come into my house to do that. That's what's supposed to be. So, I mean, in that regard, it still doesn't matter. Anyway, um, I, I think Peter Doce's statement, he lost me completely when he started giving an excuse for violence. Um, and feminism is supposed to empower women, right? That's why we preach a lot for like women getting education, a right to study whatever they want to study. Some parts mm. of the world, they can't mm. even study engineering or masculine jobs or whatever, or high paying jobs. So you know, we're advocating for people to become more empowered. And if your ego is so threatened by an empowered woman that it then results to violence, I think that that's a problem. Mm. Not that feminism is a problem there. Um, and I think that's what he was, in, in, he was um, communicating to me. That's what I heard, mm. that if you are you a bit too empowered, if you have a mind of your own, and if you want to disagree to your equal, in my opinion, your husband is your equal. So if you're, if you're disagreeing to your equal, then you've done too much. You've said that you said out of ground, and that's why you are triggering a violence attack. I think that that stuff is but awfully I'm wrong. Gonna, you know, we can say that, but when you think about the patriarchal system and you think about these laws too, don't you think they're Which encouraging laws? it? This laws of bright price. I think if you ask me, I think it should abolish. It should so be abolished. So you that you bought a a car, mm? if eh? mm. you bought a car, you paid for the car. The car mm. is yours. Does that mean you want to be smacking the car but every if I, time? If I decide to, I will. But why would you no, decide fact, to? No, uh, first off, don't so even you value. Let's let's not, don't even compare, compare a woman to a, a car. No, no, you're let's the one that's comparing. That. I'm not, no, no, wait, wait, am I, am I no, wait, brother wait, car? wait, 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 wait. If you cannot even see the fact that bashing a car is ridiculous, why would you not say that for an entire human being? What and the reason why I brought up the car as well is because you are emphasizing on how um, okay, they've bought yeah, they've the bought woman, the right? So if you don't buy... Uh, you don't, I'm you don't... emphasizing on two things and you're listening to one. Light here, listen, right? You have two years. Listen to the two things I said. Now, I said the patriarchal system and I also said the, the stop bright of price. Um, bright price. And I said in my opinion, it should be abolished. How am I standing for them? If uh, you want you to listen with the two ears. Um, I am listening. having a conversation mm. with you about what you've mm. just said. Whether or not it is you, the mm. carrier, you are speaking for the people in the back seat, I don't I really mm. don't care. You mentioned bright price, and I'm giving an example with mm. the car. Make I don't understand how that's too much. You mentioned a uh, patriarchal system, and mm. I'm saying if your ego is still as sensitive that it results to violence, you have done too much. I'm Do not, I'm I, not, I don't, I don't, I don't understand. I, okay, so Let your me point say this. is patriarchal system and the bright price store, oh, you can fly, it, could, it should go. Is that what you're saying? If I'm saying there's no excuse okay. for violence. Let's not talk about violence. We're not talking about violence. Okay. We are let's talking not, about let's violence. Not to me. Let's not um, forget the fact that, mm. yes, yes, I'm not in support of the part where he's talking about women are the ones that actually totally trigger these men to do this thing. But there's something he said that is, I think, I think it happened. Mm. Submission. Thank you. Some women don't submit. They don't submit at Jesus all. It's, it's very important. Why, why is submission a problem? Wait, the men. I meant. I'm in your in your mindset. Are men also supposed to submit? They are. The, the, the truth is, men are the head. No matter how a woman wants to, I'm talking about family now. I'm not talking about the office outside of a home. Mm. The men. The men are the head of. They are the head. So no matter how a woman wants to stand, you want to do, you want to, you still have to submit to your husband. Thank you. So I think that's where but he's I coming from. Although, oh, absolutely not. Although I'm not also. So you don't think submission is a good thing? In it a is. It I think you. I think. I you see, bet let me tell you. That will be very submissive. Let me tell you something. In, in my relationship. <laughs> yes. Let me tell you something. My relationship. Eh, we are both heads. We are doing uh, a 50-50 partnership. Oh, okay. I submit so in and he sub absolutely. Okay. I submit and he submits as well. I am not the only submitter. If you're looking for a one not, person, I'm not in my support. I'm not in support of the 50-50 in relationship. Uh, I am. No, I am. It's 100, 100. What's 50-50? And I think 50-50 well, in the sense that he is not the only person. Because you just mentioned head, right? If you say head, that means that the person has an upper hand Anyways, in making a decision. Do you understand? No. In my opinion, <laughs> I think that um, both parties have equal stake in that relationship. You agree together mm. on everything. Yes. Not that the man can then override my decision. No, it doesn't mean being ahead. the head doesn't mean you override. Okay, so what is no. the, what does the head but mean? That is just means it. being humble exactly. in a relationship. And you think it's only Humility. women that should that need that in a relationship. No, that's not what we're saying. We're, we're not talking about I'm not why, talking why about you let me be speaking for myself. This. I'm not talking this about not I'm not saying that men should not be submissive, but I just asked we you know, before you, you guys know started talking. The trick like, is eh, women eh, don't even eh, know so that what are you on about? We women, we don't even know like most of us that say, Oh, I cannot be we are actually submissive, but we don't know. Especially like me, I know I'm submissive, but I'm submissive to a man that's submissive to me. 
I'm submissive to a man that treats me like a queen and I treat the person like a king. You see, when you are equal, it is so easy to do this thing. But if I you're know. looking for somebody to boss around, I'm not doing. I, of course, eh. I, I'm, to, I'm totally submitting. Uh, so you submit every time. You submit to your friends. Like if your friends respect you, you submit to their needs sometimes. You submit to their to you compromise. The way you submit it's not to your friends deal. is totally not the same way you submit to your husband. Oh, absolutely. There but are so I'm, many I'm, I'm, ways that you even submit to your husband that you cannot submit to friends. Absolutely. Yes, I agree. <laughs> But when I asked you a question before we started, I said, Do you think that the men are supposed to submit as well? And you're like, eh, eh, eh. And that's why I disagree it's there. A like, it's actually a woman's duty to submit. That's just the honest truth. And we do it. Even those that come out and say, Oh, la, 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 they do it. They Submitting do it. is not a problem. I'll Let me tell you. you. Don't marry me, please. <laughs> God forbid. Oh, ah, God forbid. The fact oh. that you're even attracted to the, the idea is a turn off to me. Like, no, why no, are what? you getting off the fact you know that somebody what? wants to submit to you? Do you know what? Mm -hmm. if there, do you know that there are mm -hmm. ladies? Let's, let, no, let's not even go into that. Let's yeah, not go okay. into that. Please, submit to me and I'll submit to you, period. Well, yeah, move on. All right, let's move into the first story before we get effect ticking. But yes, famous Nollywood actor, movie, and producer William Suchamba reveals how one can fish out those who are easily against them. The actor took to his Instagram page to upload a video. In the viral video, he is of the opinion that anyone who believes in a rumor without in um, who believes a rumor without hearing a person's side of the story has always been searching for means to become an enemy. In his words, anybody who believes lies about you before he even hears your own part of the story has been looking for a way to be against you. Do you guys believe this? No, no, no. I don't believe it either. Mm -mm, I don't. Because there's, okay, I know certain people that I know they're capable of doing this. So if you come to me and say, if Fed did, if you tell me that, let me, okay, for instance, let me make a, a, a very, you know, popular example. Fed change jam for person. Mm. Do you understand? Mm. And then I'm not like, oh, yeah, yeah, now so she did now. And mm. I'll say that then, somebody else is going to tell you, ah, oh, that guy hates you. You know, he didn't even ask you. But I know if he's capable of yeah. changing it for anybody yeah, at true. any time. Yeah. Do you understand? So that's what it is there. So that's it, so it depends on what it is. Yeah. But I did not tell you that if I went to rob somewhere, I would say, ah, I wish if I, no, ah, ah. I would even mm. tease around, I'll play around, maybe until. I get to the police station before I even believe. Do you mm -hmm. get what I mean? Mm -hmm. Yes, but I, I don't think that's what it is in most of, yeah. most of the time. I, I'm with you on that one. It's yeah. just, you, obviously, if you know someone, you know what they're capable of doing. Mm. And again, um, this thing that if you hear something, you have to call the person first to like <laughs> um, confirm. Blah, 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 blah. I, I, I don't like it. We've if confessed you, to everything. Since if you, the if of you year. hear something about me, don't call me. Don't call me to ask me. There was one time something happened with me so i was getting calls from people that i've never they've never called me like on the norm to like check on me yeah. they're calling me to i was like what is this why you called me because of the don't call me don't call me and do that if you had anything stay with it take take have your take on it whichever mm. take you want to have on it that's fine but don't call yeah. me and, and ask me questions because tell us that thing let's no, give you our take. <laughs> <laughs> you don't want to give your take. I, I think i agree to that i think um not everyone depending on who the discussion is you know the person in matter is I don't think people care that much about the truth, um, in my opinion. Like, there's some things I'll hear about people that I know I'm friends with. I use the word lightly. Mm -hmm. But I don't, I wouldn't really care too much to now think, to start cracking my head if the person is, I'll just believe it, honestly. Except I really care about you, then I'm like, oh, really? <laughs> you know, uh, then if we, if I have that access to you, like that close access, I can say, oh, this person even said something like this. How do you feel about that? Da -da 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 -da. Or, you know, I'll try and defend the person there, but I'm not loyal to everybody. So, <laughs> if it's find out is. there that you killed somebody, eh, you killed somebody, no, me. And if I now hear, if, if the truth gets to me, oh, do you know that thing was a lie? I don't, I don't carry everybody's matter on my head yes. anyway. Yeah. Um, but I'm also going to say that I think sometimes um, perception is, is also important, which is why I don't really get upset when I see close friends or some people believe something at first, because I think that humans sometimes, I, I'm, a, I'm, I, I'm a victim of that. Where the, when I first heard the story, the way the story has been narrated with receipts, you can look guilty, and mm -hmm. I believe that, right? And then yes, you're, it's only you're until after a while, after a while that I start to hear information that, you know, if, if, I'm, if, I'm, grace, if I'm graced enough to get another perspective, then, you know, we'll do that. It's kind of, I think we remember something on this table where I was like, mm. I, we believed it totally. Oh, I think it was um, Kylie Jenner. 
when she posted something about her makeup artist, that her makeup artist needed 60,000 and she only donated 5,000, and people were going crazy that why would she only donate 5,000? She has a lot of money, da 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 da. da. And it kind of looked bad, right? And until, only when she came out to say, when she was the one applying, um, um, uh, when she saw it, it was only 10,000. She, so she actually gave all the money and an extra you know so at first it looked like that's what it was so i think i you have to give space for humans like that like it is possible that the person doesn't mean harm mm -hmm. they just just um working with what they've got at that moment and then when they hear the truth they'll readjust as but well. not to act ignorant like we don't know there are some people that are just waiting to hear bad news about you i oh, think yeah. that's what i was going to say yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah there are some people that are just waiting they just to sit hear there and wait, like, like, want like to they hear just it. look at you and they look like how can one person be so blessed? Yeah, Do you understand? Sure. And then at the end of the day, when someone just says one to say, maybe um, you call somebody and you're like, oh, I had an accident. Maybe you just hit your car. They're like, ah, the car's boy. Wait, I ain't can't come walk now. Mm. Now the next question, you don't even know the extent of the accident. Mm. You know that? But the next question, how you can't come walk? Hey, and, mm. and if I know the entire boss, so. Mm. <laughs> Do you get that kind of mm. thing? Like, you're already sure, thinking sure. the worst. Why are you thinking the worst? Yeah. Why yeah. didn't you just wait to see me? Yeah. Do you understand? And, yeah. and I think on the flip side as well, I know people who start the negative stuff that does not even happen. Oh, did you know? All of a sudden, from inside of them, the yeah. super story and create a, uh, and, uh, you know, a perspective that that has never happened. Oh, I heard that she and they just create one nice, juicy, bad story and let that one spread. I've seen that a lot mm, as well. Mm. But if that's what he's talking about, then yeah. Anyways, let's go on a quick music break and tea time. We'll be right back.